Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stacia Zapalaca. If you've never been here before, but if you have, hi girl. Okay, buenos dias you guys. Como andamos, como amanecimos. Voy a empezar a cocinar right away because I actually haven't ferment in like 40 minutes and I still have to do my hair. But I wanted to vlog today. Me quería juntar contigo, I wanted to hang out with you. Quería que pasáramos tiempo juntas. And I kind of wanted to tell you guys about my appointment today. And I also wanted to go shopping, okay? So there's a lot going on today. Um, a lot of good things, a lot of exciting things. And of course I'm sharing them with you because I love to hang out with you. I like, I look a little bit weird because I'm not wearing lipstick yet. Porque voy a desayunar primero. So if I look a little pale down here, you know why? So right now, I'm actually gonna have some breakfast before I have my appointment with an image consultant. Ahora, ya sé cómo van a decir, Stacy, ¿por qué estás haciendo eso? You're being so extra about it. ¿Por qué? O sea, ¿por qué en el mundo would you hire an image consultant? And let me tell you, girl, I got sucked in by TikTok. So first of all, I found this image consultant on TikTok. Eh, aparentemente, ella te dice qué colores te quedan mejor for your skin tone, okay? Now, personally, myself, there's been a couple of colors that I wear, and you guys will tell me like, oh my God, that color looks so good on you. Like, red is one of the colors you guys always tell me it looks so good on me. There's like various colors where you guys tell me like, oh my God, these colors look so great on you, and then there's some colors where I never get any compliments on them. So, I do believe in color theory, y si en verdad mente creo que muchas personas or todos tenemos unos colores que nos quedan mejor que otros. I just don't know what colors are the ones that make me look good or that make my skin tone stand out and which ones are not it. I think ideally you would see her in person, but she's from Canada, so obviously no voy a ir a Canada para que me hagan este, este examen. So she says that she could do the test on you online. So what I have to do is first of all, you do have to pay, it's not free. And once you pay, she sends you a WhatsApp message and she tells you like, hey, thank you so much for inquiring about my services. I need you to send me, like I think she said three different pictures with no makeup on and a white top on. So I had to send her a picture from the front, from my left side and from my right side. And basically what she does, según yo no sé, is she looks like you're under, Color, ¿cómo se llama? You know how you see my skin color that's like this skin color? We all have undertones, so I think I'm yellow undertone because I always tell my mom and like I always tell like, en nuestra familia siempre decimos I'm yellow. Like Amy, for example, my brother and my sister, they're like lighter complexion and obviously I am pretty light, but I'm yellow, like my undertone is yellow. My mom is also a good example of somebody whose undertone is yellow. I don't really know much about it. Maybe I'm like butchering this whole thing. We're gonna find out and the image consultant is gonna tell me basically what colors look best on me. So, estoy emocionada, la verdad. Yes, I'm very excited porque I know now what colors I'm gonna be able to wear and I'm gonna be able to wear like to look really like to stand out and to have the best colors for my personal skin tone. El color que tengo ahorita va a ser el mismo color que voy a tener por toda mi vida. So I felt a little bit better about spending this money because I was like, okay, well, I'm gonna have this test for the rest of my life, so it's gonna work. Is it extra? Yes, but I wanted to try it out. Genuinely, I think the best colors for me are like the brighter colors, like the reds, the oranges, the bright pinks, you know, pero pues, we're gonna see what she says. I'm gonna have some breakfast right now and then we're gonna talk to her. After that, we're gonna go shopping. I haven't been shopping in a long time. Y ya me hace falta. La neta, ya me hace falta. Se vale. It's time to go shopping. But for now, let me have my breakfast. I'm gonna do my hair and then I'll see you guys when we're about to talk to her. carro me cambié me cambié because that baby pink that i was wearing it didn't suit me really well like okay i'm completely in shock you guys i just finished 
the session with the color analyst specialist. No sé cómo se dice. But she told me that I'm cool tone. You guys, toda mi vida yo creí that I was warm tone. And she told me it's very common. She says that normally people that have like a Hispanic background or a Asian background or backgrounds like that. She says that a lot of times we get confused for warmer tones because we have yellow in our skin tone. But she says that your undertone is different than your skin tone. It's basically not the same thing. So apparently, yo soy cool tone. I never knew. To me, I was always like, well, I'm warm tone. Like, duh, I'm like yellow. So why wouldn't I be warm tone? She told me that the best metals, like for my skin tone, like for jewelry, would be white gold. I was like, oh no, estás loca. No way. No way, because I never wear white gold. You guys know how much I don't like white gold, so I literally can't imagine. But we are gonna give it a try. Right now, if you guys are wondering, we're actually heading to the mall real quick, you guys, because mañana es el cumpleaños de la Samantha y le tenemos que comprar un regalo. So I figured we would go to the mall. I actually have a meeting at 3 p.m. So it's 12.30 right now. We'll probably get to the mall like around one. And then we're gonna shop for a gift for Sammy. And then I would say, algo para nosotros. And then we had to come back home for our meeting at 3 p.m. But yes, I see el día, you guys. So far, so good. I literally can't believe I'm cool tone. I was like, no way. But she did tell me. She's like, the best hair color for you is definitely the dark hair color that you have right now. She's like, um, I was like, oh my God, that makes so much sense. I was like, I should never go blonde, huh? And she's like, yeah, blonde doesn't really do you well for your skin tone. And I was like, no wonder. Porque cada vez que me pinta el cabello güero, what happens? I look like a hot mess. Like it just blends all too much, you know? Like it's not a good look for me, for me. Like I feel like blonde hair looks so good, like on Amy, for example, or like on other people that I've met, but I'm, on me personally, no se me hace que se me ve bonito. We are gonna, I'm gonna take you guys with me. A ver, que encontramos for Sammy, because tomorrow's her birthday. Y a ver, que nos encontramos para nosotras, because you know that every time you buy somebody else a gift, you have to get yourself a gift too. So, vámonos al mall. I just got back in the car. We definitely did some shopping. So I got some stuff at Bath and Body Works. I got some stuff at Morphe. And I mean, compré algo en Zara. It was nice. I hadn't come to the mall in a really, 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 really long time. But it's already two o'clock. Y tengo esa junta a las tres. We had to head back to my house. Probably gonna get something to eat. When we get to the house, les enseño que compramos. Porque compré muchas cosas muy bonitas. And I bought Samantha's gift as well. Um, it wasn't anything like super, like, outstanding. Que dije yo, oh my God, esto me recuerda a la Samuel Mil. But... Um, there are some things that I got her, so hopefully she likes them, she enjoys them. Ahorita se los voy a enseñar. No sé qué comer. Probablemente vamos a comer something on the road because tenemos esa junta a las 3 p.m. 3 de la tarde. So, vámonos a la casita a descansar y continuamos. Hello, guys. Welcome back to the day after. Woo! Today's the day after. I actually just got you guys from outside of my... Jeep because I just didn't tell you. Pero les quería enseñar qué compramos ayer because I got a couple of good things and I also wanted to show you guys what we ended up getting. Samantha, aka Mexican Shunli. Today is actually her birthday, pero ya nos había dicho que quería pasar su cumple, like her actual birthday, with her boyfriend and their dog. So no vamos a ver a la Sammy hoy hasta el hasta el sábado, creo. She wanted to go to a bar and have a couple of drinks. I'm getting all the stuff that I did some shopping with yesterday. Honestly, I'm kind of sad that I kind of had to rush out of the mall because I love to go shopping. Me gusta ir shopping. Okay, can I put you there? Does that look good? I hope so. Okay. Should I show you what I got Sam first? Yeah, I'm gonna show you what I got Sam first. I don't have to write happy birthday card. But I got her this one from Tarjay and it says, 
all the stars aligned the day you were born today is your day wish big yeah yeah intro you say may your wildest dreams come true were you guys turning that's the car that i got her and then i kind of got her like a little stacy diaz starter kit okay so Muchas de ustedes me preguntan muchas veces what is my favorite lipstick, right? And what you guys are always like, what lipstick are you wearing? What lipstick are you wearing? I'm finally gonna tell you. First of all, a couple of things. I got le compré dos lipsticks a la Sami, okay? So write this down because you guys always ask me, so I'm gonna tell you right now. El lipstick que siempre me pongo, like the one I'm always always wearing, is Virgin by Morphe this one so this is the lipstick i always wear that i get a lot of compliments on virgin by morphe ahora el que traigo ahorita porque ya que fui i was like well let me just see other ones let me see if there's anything else that i like uh i swatched a bunch of them and i also got one for myself and one for sammy so this one that i'm wearing is called Baxi love look se me ve bien bonito, huh? Ahora, todos los lipsticks son diferentes y también depende de tu tono de piel and like what you personally like to look like. So, as I found out yesterday, I'm cool tone, so muted cool colors look good on me. Crazy, right? So, I bought Sammy the virgin one and the backseat love one. So, I figure she loves lipstick, I love lipstick, so I bought her that. I'm gonna give her a fall candle. I don't know which one to give her though. So, I got this one that's called leaves and this one that's called autumn. So, these are the two that I got. They're, they smell really good. So, this is what I got her. No es nada super, oh my god, out of this world amazing but it is something cute and this is the little birthday bag that I got her and then the paper. So that's what I got for Samantha Raya. Que cumple 29 añitos. Feliz cumpleaños a mí. You're one of my closest and bestest friends and I am so grateful that I have such a reliable, trustworthy and amazing human as a friend. It is Un ejemplo a seguir, la verdad. I love you as a friend and I hope that our friendship is lifelong. Let me now show you, para no ponernos extra cursi. So yo que me compré. Yo me compré another one of the Virgin from Morphe, another one of Backseat Love, the one that I'm wearing. Pero también me compré uh, este lipstick que se llama Morphe. So this one's Morphe by Morphe. Y lo compré because I already have a real lipstick. I normally use the Kat Von D one. Pero ayer después de que tuve esa sesión de color swatching, a ver qué colores me quedaban mejor, I bought this one because, okay, so I the red lipsticks are red lipsticks. So one red lipstick may not look good on everybody. So you have to go based on whichever one looks good on you. This is like a more muted red i'm not gonna wear it right now but i hope it looks good on me i'm gonna show it to you guys when i wear it i got to go to zara okay yo casi nunca compro en la zara porque siempre está lleno de gente o sea todos los fines de semana está atascado y me da hueva así es que casi nunca compro ahí pero esta vez sí paré and it wasn't that busy so i got myself this nice button up like a silky button up ahora les quiero enseñar los colores que dijo la image consultant that are good for me she sent me my color palette and look let me show it to you guys so apparently these are the colors that look best on me so this is kind of crazy like i kind of like these this is the color like i'm currently wearing right now i always wear this color and i think a lot of you i always get a lot of compliments so look here's a bright red and then like a darker gray and an ivory so supuestamente esos son los colores que me quedan mejor so she diagnosed me this is like the little file she sent me so let's see what she said palette specifications i'm color based blue medium brightness and medium depth so aparentemente no me puedo poner colores que estén super bright uh, y no me puedo poner colores que estén super muted right so this kind of makes sense recommended hair color so let me read this to you guys uh, medium to deep cool brown base optional platinum blonde highlights in moderation avoid warm red and warm 
blonde because it creates sallowness. So I'm right on track with my hair color. This is my natural hair color, so Dios nunca se equivoca. Ya sabemos eso. Lips, cool and muted. So it makes perfect sense why these lipsticks look good on me. And then avoid warm colors. I literally, you guys, thought I was a warm color person my whole life. Okay, so clothing, keep your clothing within your cool summer palette. She said jewelry, silver, white gold, and platinum would look good on me. That I had to disagree with her on because I love yellow gold, as we know, and I, per I feel like yellow gold always looks the best on me. I tried to go shopping with that in mind yesterday. So I got this color. So this is a cool muted pink. Y cada vez que este color, you guys, me, you compliment me a lot. This is kind of like the color of the lipstick that I'm always wearing. I also switched my blush to like a more pinky one. And then if you guys notice, the glitter in my eyes is como más plateadito. So I kind of, like, I'm not going to start wearing like white gold jewelry right off the get-go. Porque, o sea, no voy a cambiar mi vida así de una. But I do want to wear colors that are more suited for me. Eh, que me hagan verme más sofisticada, más elegante. That attract people to me. I think she did say is that when you're not wearing colors that suit you well o sea la gente te ve así como que en 3d like they see you and then they see your outfit right like when you're wearing a color that's really nice people are like oh that's a really nice dress o sea te están dando el compliment on your dress not really on how you look and i don't know if you guys can relate pero si hay veces que a veces traigo algo puesto y la gente me dice oh my god se te ve bien bonito que bonita te ves en vez de que bonito se ve tu vestido you know so you don't really want to get compliments that are like your dress is so nice you really want to get compliments that are like you look so well put together i also got this shirt so this shirt is also a cool muted like greenish main color so este color también se me ve bonito i wish i could have i'm gonna go get a shirt so you guys can see a color that wouldn't look good on me so something or un color que no se me vería bonito en mi opinión es el amarillo like a really bright yellow i have never been able to make yellow work for me and for my skin tone and the reason for that is is because yellow is on the complete opposite side of blue which is like the foundation of the cool colors so let me go get like a yellow piece of clothing if i could even find one hold on okay you guys so this is how you know, like, esto era antes de que la, la consultant me dijera nada. I just never wear yellow, porque, o sea, a mí se me hace que no se me ve bien. And I was onto something, because literal no tengo nada amarillo en mi closet. There's not one single piece of yellow clothing, but my sister has this sweater. So I'm going to kind of try to show you guys what I mean. So, look. When I put it against my face like this, I hope you're able to tell. Pero, o sea, se me hace como que está como que completamente diferente. It looks, it clashes with my hair. It clashes with my skin tone. It doesn't look good. And then when I take this off, notice how everything just looks more cohesive. It like, it looks well put together. Así como que todo va junto, right? So look, let me do it one more time. So it looks cohesive. It goes well put together. And then look. Do you see that change? Like when I put the yellow piece of clothing to my face, como que my face looks like more intense. Se ve más intenso, se ve más separado todo. Cuando tengo un color que me va con mi color de piel, everything looks like it flows together. I wanted to do this image consulting para ver qué era, para ver qué me decían, just to get to know more about myself. As you guys know, I'm a person that likes to be pretty self-aware and I'm a person que le encanta saber más de mí misma. O sea, cualquier cosa que yo pueda hacer para mejorarme, para asegurarme de que me vea de la mejor manera, that I am speaking in the best way, that I am elevating my look and I'm elevating myself, I'm gonna do. Ahora, ya que tengo este conocimiento, ya puedo, I can go shopping for clothing that it's gonna suit me and my skin tone best and so that it doesn't look like I'm clashing with my clothes. Hopefully this vlog was entertaining for you guys. Hopefully you guys liked it. I am gonna let you guys go. I have to go edit this vlog and I have to go upload it for you guys. I, I'm genuinely happy that I did this consultation. Si ustedes quieren saber what your kind of skin tone is, I'm sure you can look it up on YouTube. I'm sure you can look at different videos and stuff because there's a bunch of knowledge if you would like to personally 
do this for yourself i actually hire a consultant just to be extra and to like know exactly but you don't have to do that if you don't want to so definitely let me know what you guys think do you guys can you guys believe i'm cool tone yo jamás creía que yo era cool tone player literal eso fue lo que me dejó más shocked de todo literal pero bueno ahora ya sabemos qué colores me pongo para verme bonita para verme bella that's gonna be it for me guys las quiero mucho I hope you guys had fun today that you enjoyed this video las quiero mucho quédate mucho respétate más and I'll see you in the next video bye